There is something you might be doing wrong every single day. And what I'm talking about is shutting down your Mac. Hi everyone, it's Luke from Apple Online Academy and I'm here to help you learn new things about your Mac and take a good care about your computer. If you subscribe, I'll make sure to bring you a lot of useful tips in the future. And one of them is to clear out the myth about shutting down your computer. I barely turn up mine like maybe once in few months or maybe when I'm traveling somewhere, but otherwise I keep it on all the time. You think you might be saving your Mac by shutting it down when you finish the work, maybe saving some power or even saving the battery. But what you're actually doing is that you're preventing your computer from doing some background tasks, from some very simple basic daily maintenance. Tasks which are supposed to be done while you're not using the Mac. If you think I'm making it up, check out the official support page from Apple. I will leave you a link in the description. It talks there about something called power nap. They call it power nap instead of sleeping because it's getting things done. It's not just sleeping. Power nap can be controlled in system preferences. It's enabled by default, but there are a few settings you can change about it. If you've got a MacBook, then you are going to see two tabs here. One is for when you are plugged into a power, and one when you're just using the battery. You can decide if you want to turn it on or off for each one of them. There is actually a lot behind the scenes work what is done when you're not using the Mac. And it's not taking any power, it's doing it in very low mode. It search for updates, it makes some backups, and what is very important, it's also indexing the files. If you don't let the Mac do this, it means that it will slow down the overall computer performance, or it will be doing these tasks when you are actually using it. So put down your Mac to sleep instead of shutting down. And there is one more extra advantage to it. It's actually always ready to be used. You just come in, press the spacebar, and it's instantly ready to be working on. You don't need to go through these starting up processes all the time. So basically all you need to do is to get a fast and responsive Mac, is to do nothing. If you have a desktop Mac at home like iMac, you just walk away and it will go to sleep automatically. If you have a MacBook, MacBook Pro or MacBook Air, you can just close the lid and it will do the same. It put your computer to sleep. So don't worry about shutting down your Mac, you're not saving anything, it's actually a bad thing to do. Leave it on, let it sleep and instantly turn it on when you need it again. But I hope this quick video didn't make you fall asleep. And if you haven't done it yet, click on the subscribe button not to miss out any future tips. This is Luke and I will see you again.